today we're going to be doing a updated what's in my purse for the springtime and this has been the purse that I've been carrying around with me lately. It is from Kate Spade. I got it for Christmas but I think it is perfect for the springtime because it has like eyelet and stuff on it. I don't know. This is just like the definition of spring to me in a bag and I'm really really liking it. I don't know exactly what it's called. Um, but I know that you can get it at the outlet and it comes in a lot of different colors and a lot of different shapes. So if you're interested, I would check out your local Kate Spade outlet. But yeah, without further ado, let's get into it. Alright, so this is what my purse looks like on the inside. It is stuffed and it is messy and I've been needing to do this like three weeks ago. So um, this is going to be an interesting what's in my bag, but let's just pull out the biggest thing, which is my planner. I have an Erin Condren planner and I have the palm leaf kind of cover. I really, really like it. It fits perfect in my bag and I use it for work and for YouTube and for other projects that I'm doing and just for like life in general. I really, really like it. If you want to see maybe like a how I organize my planner kind of video, let me know. I can do that for you guys. But yep, that's the first thing that I always keep with me. Next thing I have are my glasses, and I have two pairs of glasses. My, like, real, real glasses are my car that are, my, like, my really updated prescription because I need to be able to see when I'm driving. Um, but these are just, like, my spare glasses that I keep with me when I'm going to work and stuff. So, so if I start to get, like, a headache or something from looking at the computer screen for a little too long, I break these bad boys out. They're Kate Spade. I've had them for forever. They look like this on... Maybe they make me look smarter or something. I don't know. But yep, I just keep those in my purse just in case. Next thing I have is a bag of almonds um, because I always have to have a snack with me and almonds are those things that you don't really feel guilty about. And they're pretty good if you want something a little bit saltier. So I have food in my bag. Next thing I have is my cell phone. I have an iPhone 6 and my case is from Nordstrom Rack in case you were wondering. But yeah, that's what's going on there. Um, I have a pay stub, which is always a good thing. Um, I have a couple of, like, icebreaker things. I have the icebreaker mints, the candy cane from Christmas that I'm still working on. And then I also have the icebreaker sours, which are super, super good, especially if you're having a craving for something sweet. This kind of, like, curbs that, and it's just really delicious. I have a Tide Go pen because I'm accident prone and I don't want to walk around with like a stain on my shirt so I have one of these. I have my little wallet if you even want to call it a wallet. Ooh, that rhymed. This is from Kate Spade. If you can't tell, I really like Kate Spade. And it's more just like a card holder, but it holds all of my cards. It holds all my licenses and reward cards and stuff in here. And it's not too expensive, especially if you get it on sale. I would definitely recommend this to somebody if you carry around like a smaller bag. You don't want your wallet to literally take up like 90% of the space in your bag. Um, so yeah, I have this. I have $5, which is exciting. Um, I have my sunglasses and a TJ Maxx receipt. These are Ray-Bans and they probably should be in their case because they're kind of expensive. But I live life on the edge and just kind of throw them in my purse. But these are just black on um, black Ray-Bans and I think they're really cool. I have some hand sanitizer. This is Fresh Sparkling Snow from um, Bath & Body Works, obviously. And I have two lip balms, um, both from Burt's Bees. I have the replenishing one, which is, I think, the pomegranate one. And then I just recently got this pink grapefruit one, and I've been really liking it. So, gotta stay moisturized. I literally have so many lip products in here. It is not even funny. Let me try and collect them all so I can really just show you. Like, my purse is 90% lipstick. So not counting the lip balms, I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 lipsticks in my purse, which is kind of obnoxious. The first one I have is Brave from MAC. It's a really good just everyday color. Next, I have this little sample from Tony Moly. Um, it's a delight tint thing. It's in the number red. It's okay. I have a Pop Beauty lipstick in the shade Satin Rose. I have Revlon's Rose HD lipstick, which is what I'm wearing right now. I have Too Faced Teddy Berry, which is one of my all-time favorites. I have L'Oreal Paris's Lilac in the shade like Chocolac, I think. I have Bite Beauty's Pecan, which is one of those like flat ones, and it melted, which is no good. And then finally, I have the NYX's um, Whip Caviar, which is another like all-time staple in my purse. Yes, I have a problem. I was just throw the lipstick I'm wearing that day in my purse and never take it out, so. I have a lot of receipts, which is not very interesting. 
I have more trash. I have what looks to be like a grocery list, so that's cool. I have a binder clip. Okay. I have a couple of pins because you can never be without a pen, especially like colorful pins. I have a hand lotion, which is what I need to use right now because my hands are super, super dry. Um, this came in a birch box, I believe, and it is the, um, the Soap and Paper Factory Shea Butter Hand Cream, I guess. I really like it. It's supposed to smell like green tea, and it does smell pretty good. Let's see. More trash. Literally, the majority of my bag is like lipstick and trash, so that's good. I have my I Heart Manatees little paper thing that went into a keychain, but the keychain broke and this fell out of it, so I need to fix that. But it says I Heart Manatees, and it has a picture of a manatee on the other side, and I do heart manatees, so. I have more paste ups because I don't know, they just stay in my bag. Um, I have a Banana Republic gift card that I've had for forever and I really need to use. I have like a flyer, some mail. Um, a piece of paper oh, from the vet. I had to take Bentley to the vet. She's a very expensive little doggy. Um, speaking of Bentley, I have a poop bag because I'm a responsible pet owner. And I guess really all I have left is some like change and some more trash at the bottom of my bag. But this is what it looks like emptied out and I guess that's everything that was in my bag. Which is kind of sad because literally it's majority trash. Um, but I'm glad I got to clean out my bag with you guys. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and let me know and I can do another one for the summertime maybe. Uh, but yeah, that is everything for today's video and I will see you guys in a couple of days. Bye y'all!